After four years, Lotus Avaya is ready to be handed over to its owners. Four years after the Lotus Avaya prototype was introduced and finally ready to be handed over to its buyers, the Avaya was introduced precisely in July 2019, not only being the first hypercar from Lotus, but also the first electric car from the brand. Since its introduction, however, the hypercar has experienced various production challenges but at the 2023 Goodwood Festival of Speed, a representative from Lotus stated that first deliveries to customers will begin at Monterey Car Week next month. At the Goodwood Festival of Speed, Lotus unveiled a special edition of Via Emerson Fittipaldi edition, which is the first of eight cars with this specification. However, there is something that steals the attention, namely the Lotus Neo symbol on this car is not Lotus. Quoted from CarBuzz, July 17, it means that the car owner is from China, and this car will be sent there. In China, the Lotus brand is registered, so all Lotus models sold in the country bear the Lotus Neo logo, which means New Lotus. It is known that China is the largest automotive market in the world, and after Lotus was purchased by a Chinese car manufacturer, Geely, this brand had to adjust its identity because the ownership rights to the name were never registered by the sports car manufacturer there. Previously it was reported that all 130 units of the Avaya hypercar were already on order, and apparently Lotus confirmed that some units are still available for order. The Avaya is powered by two electric motors and can produce 1,972 horsepower and 1,704 newton meters of torque making it an extraordinary car, especially considering it only weighs 1,680 kg. All power comes from a 70 kWh lithium-ion battery positioned behind the cockpit. These batteries can be upgraded as battery technology advances and these batteries can be replaced with new battery modules that have the same configuration. But when it comes to capabilities, Avaya is slightly inferior to Remit's Navera and Pininfarina Batista, but there is still potential to develop this Lotus hypercar. Now for buyers who are interested in purchasing the remaining units, one Avaya unit is valued at around 2.6 million United States dollars or around 39 billion Indonesian rupees. <laughs> 